So I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you this. When I you know, because we've all been around fake hype guys, right? We've all been around the, the show guy, the guy that's like, you know, Spicoli, where you're like not sure if it's I wrote that in my note. Right, where if it's real or not real, is that really him? Is it really go to bed that, at night like that? He does. That is real. That is, that's not an act. That's not for show. That is, he's just that's the way his his circuits are wired. So getting him to come around, was that indicative of the buy-in you generally needed as you tried to change your culture here? Yeah, which surprised me. A guy that wants to win so badly, that loves Texas so passionately, that took so long to, 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 to give us his heart. You know, that was, it was odd to me. Um, but, but once he did, man, it was... Again, like, I, I mean, we're, that's my dude, you know. Do you let your mind drift to when you see the hair flowing out of the helmet in practice to, to cutting it off on, on a stage someday? No. No. I don't let my mind drift except to tomorrow, to going one and oh tomorrow, Pete. All right. Good when he said he loved you, one thing that he said that I thought was interesting was, you know, I asked him, I said, are you convinced that there's enough guys in the room that are as passionate as you? And, you know, he's like starting to... He, he, said, he said he feels like all the cliques have melted away, feels like all the groups have melted away, and that there truly is a one group. I don't know what his word is, but that's what he's. All the cliques have melted away. Do you see that? I mean, have you seen that in the room that you've got more buy-in now than you've ever? I felt. I feel it, um, yeah. and and I've been told that from okay. guys that I trust. Right. Um, but I mean, I. I kind of leave, let the locker room be the, the player sanctuary, so I'm not necessarily in there all the time. But um, I, I, I feel it for sure. Yeah. Because the bowl game truly seems like a, a seminal moment, line in the sand of, of your program. I, I would I would argue the three weeks leading up to the bowl game was okay. the, the preparation. Okay. Right? You know, these guys let their hair down. They were looser. They had fun. We didn't work any less. We didn't work any less hard. I think they embraced it with a different attitude, and, um, and we had more fun. We got to know each other. We, you know, it's like, dude, let down the shield. You know, it's like, just stop for once, please. If you want to win this bowl game, it's it, this is like the um, you know the line in the sand, if you will. And and for the most part, they did. Are you gonna secure the bag this year? Not? You had a question. <laughs> That was, funny. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah, but, I'm not. It wasn't mean spirited. Yeah, no, no, I just yeah, can't. Yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna answer. He's, he's being. He's being polite. <laughs> yes. I know he is. He's being polite.